I first came to Hampton Court the summer I was 13. A beautiful hot summer's day and we came the proper way down the river. And you know at that age you are so open, so vulnerable to everything. I didn't know much Tudor history. I knew that picturesque kind that is taught to children. I did know who Wolsey was. I don't think I knew who Thomas Cromwell was, so I didn't see his ample black shape leaning on the windowsill when I came into the Wolsey rooms. But I remember coming into that panelled room and feeling suddenly everything hit me. And I, I really still don't know what it was, but it was the pressure of history. It was the weight of history, if you like. I began to cry. And it was as if the past had just enveloped me like a blanket and I was fighting for breath. And I didn't know what it was about, but I did have the powerful feeling that it would be okay if I sat down on the floor of the Wolsey rooms and just passed the rest of my life there. That seemed logical. I was walking away then, herded and jostled with the other tourists, walking into my future. But I think it may also have been the moment when I turned around and started walking back into the past. <laughs>